All right, in this tutorial video, I'm going to go ahead and show you how to download our title block from Power School Learning and opening it up in Inventor. So if we open up PSL and we come to my resources page, at the very bottom, if you scroll all the way down, um, I have a section called Inventor Title Block. If you just click on the IDW uh, title block file, what you will need to do is make sure that you save it into your inventor practice folder. Um, inside your inventor practice folder, you should have all of your part files as well. Um, so your black, your yellow, your green, your blue, and your purple parts. Uh, you want to make sure that you get this title block saved within this folder. Otherwise, when all of the files that you work with um, for your multi-view drawings and like your assembly files, your presentation files, if all your parts are in different places, they're not going to show up in, in your files. Um, and so you always want to make sure that you're saving everything into the same folder. And that's why I've been stressing file management is so important, especially with Inventor. Otherwise, your parts are going to disappear on you. So. I have my title block here. Um, it is kind of a funky name, so um, if you want, I would just call it empty title block so that you know that this one is, there's nothing in it. It's empty. Um, and then when we save, we'll save it as a new name. That way, if you need to go back and you need to, you know, redo something or use this file again, you know that this one is empty. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and press save. And I saved it in my Google Drive. Now you do have a button right here that you can go ahead and press, but um, I want to get you in good habits. So what we'll do is we'll toggle over to Inventor. And I always want you to try to remember to use this open button, or you can come to file open. They work the exact same way. And then inside your Inventor practice folder, um, go ahead and open up your empty title block or whatever the file is that you named. Uh, your title block as. And we'll go ahead and press the open button. It will take a minute to load, especially if you're using app stream through the web browser. Um, remember, Inventor is a really powerful software that is not meant to run through a web browser. So the fact that it is even able to run through the web browser um, is pretty impressive. Um, and that's why you're experiencing that, that delay or that lag. Um, so just be patient with it. All right, so this is our inventor title block that we're going to use here for Huntley High School. And uh, we'll get into kind of the details of the title block a little bit later. Um, but this is how you go ahead and open it. And in the next tutorial video, you will learn how to place your part on the title block. Um, and then we'll get into dimensioning and how to add new sheets so that you don't have to create five new separate files for each of your parts. They'll all live into uh, the single IDW.